Are you ready to create mind-blowing blogs in just a matter of seconds? Yes, we are talking about AI content, but it's not just any usual blog content that we get from ChatGPT. This one is unpredictable. What does that mean? Well, Google will have no clue that it's AI generated, nor will your readers. But how does it help you in any way? This AI content scored an incredible 98% originality score, which means your content is more human-like and it has a better chance to rank on Google and get more traction on your site. So guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can quickly create blog posts that really makes a difference. Well, we usually generate content from ChatGPT, which would look something like this. But with this AI tool called Gravity Write, we'll be able to create a blog like this. You can see it is much more detailed and well-crafted. We're going to see everything step by step, right from getting ideas for your content, adding images and everything using AI. The best part is it's completely free and all this takes less than 10 minutes. So get ready guys, let's dive right in to create our blogs. We are going to do six steps. The first step is to log into Gravity Write. I've given a link in the description, so just click it and it'll take you to this page. Now click start writing for free, enter your name, email and give a password. Click sign up. Now to start creating blogs, if you go to blog workflow, you can see different tools here. We are going to use these tools to create our blog. So let's go to the second step, which is to get a topic idea for your blog. Now, if you already have a topic for your blog, you can skip to the next step. But if you're open to explore different ideas, just click blog topic idea. Now here, if you enter a keyword related to the type of blog you want, Gravity Write will generate different topics which you can use. So let's try that out. I'm going to enter my keyword which is 5 innovative business ideas. Now click create and as you can see we've got some interesting topics. You can go ahead and select the topic you want. I'm going to choose this topic for my blog. Okay, once we have the topic we can now go to the next step which is to create an outline for our blog. As I told you earlier this is a step by step process. So first we're going to create an outline for our blog and then create the full content. This way you will get a more detailed content and you can also decide what to include in your blog and what not to include. All right, so to create the outline, first, let's copy the topic we chose. Click on blog outline, paste the topic here and click create. As you can see, we've got the outline for our blog. If you go through it, you will find the headings and the description of the content. Now, if you want to change anything or add something, just click anywhere and start editing. Here we have food delivery. Instead of that, I'm going to change it to food and beverage industry. You can go on and make more customization. And voila, we've got the perfect outline for our blog. So let's copy this and paste it in a document. Once we have an outline, let's go to the fourth step, which is to create the content for our blog. We are going to create the content based on the outline. So let's copy the outline. Go back to gravity, right? And click blog content. Now paste the outline here. And here we need to enter the title of our blog. So let's copy paste that. Now if you click create content, you can see that the full content for our blog is ready. Like we saw before, you can edit the content if you want. Once you're done, there we go. Our blog content is ready. So let's copy this and paste it on a doc. So once we've got the content, what next? You can see our blog looks a bit plain. So what we need now is a bunch of images to make it look better. And not just that, adding images will help in SEO and also to engage your readers. Now the best part is we're going to create images also using AI. So let's go to the next step, which is to add images to your blog. Now to add images, first, we're going to find what kind of images we need for our blog. If we look at our blog, we have different headings and we need to come up with image ideas for each topic. To make it easier for us, Gravity Write has a tool which will analyze your content and it will tell you what kind of image you need to add for each heading on your blog. So let's find out. Just copy the content. Go back to this tab and click image brief. Now if you paste the content here and click create content, 
you can see it tells us what image to add under each heading. Not just that, it has given us prompts for each image which we can use on image generation tools like Midjourney, Blue Willows, etc. and create the same images mentioned here. Amazing, right? This has made our work a lot easier. Okay, now we know what images to add. So next, we're going to create those images using the prompts here. First, let's copy this and paste it on our doc. Now to create the images, we're going to use a free AI tool called Blue Willows. I've given the link in the description to all these tools. So just click it and it'll take you to this page. Now I've already created an account on Blue Willows. So if you don't have one, you can create it and you'll reach this page. Now to create images, we need to enter the prompts. So let's go here, copy this prompt, go to Blue Willows. Now to enter the prompt here, type slash imagine, then paste the prompt and press enter. You can see we've got some images. If you like any image, just select the version here and you'll get the image. Now to download the image, just select it. Now right click on it, select save image as, click save and the image will be downloaded. And now we've got the image for our blog. So let's go back to this tab and add the image. Alright, in the same way you can create the images you want using these prompts and add them to your blog. It's that easy. So once you're done, you can now see our blog looks great. Okay, so we've successfully added images to our blog and it's now ready. Now before we go ahead and publish the blog, let's say you want to create a featured image like this which makes our blog more attractive. So next, let's see how you can create a featured image for your blog. To do that, we're going to use an online tool called Canva. Now I've added the link in the description, so just click it and you will reach this page. Now to create a featured image, just like the blog thumbnail. Now instead of creating an image from scratch, we're going to select a template and edit it. So here you can see different templates. You can select the one you want. I'm going to select this one. Now here we have a default image and text. So let's edit it. I'm going to change this text and add my blog title here. Now to change the image, just select it and click delete. Now just drag and drop any image you want from the computer and drag it to adjust the position. Okay, so now our featured image is ready. So let's download it. Click share and click download and again click download. And now the image will be downloaded. Okay, once we got the featured image, let's go to the final step which is to publish the blog on our website. Now if you don't have a blog website, you can learn how to create one by watching this video. Okay, so to publish the blog, let's go to our WordPress dashboard Go to Posts and click Add New. Now here we need to enter the title for our blog. So let's go here, copy the title and paste it here. Next, let's go ahead and copy paste the content of our blog. Now to add a featured image, click here and go to our featured image. Now drag and drop the image we created. Next, let's add a category for our blog. Just click here and I'm going to create a new category. Now let's enter a name and click add. Okay, now to publish the blog, just click publish and again click publish. Now to view our blog post, click view post and you can see that we've got our blog and it has all the content that we created. Okay, so that's it guys, we've successfully created an entire blog post just by using AI. Now let's compare this output with what ChatGPT can create for the same blog title. I'm going to ask ChatGPT to write a blog on our same title. And this is the output. Now if we compare, you can see that our blog is much more detailed and well structured, while ChatGPT has created a normal and generic content. All right. Now how do we check the quality of the content? I'm going to add both of these content to an AI detector and see how human-like they are. First, let's copy the ChatGPT's result and then go to this website. This is an AI detector tool. So I'm going to paste the content here 
And now if we click check for AI content, you can see the score here. It says the content is more robotic and it is AI generated. Okay, now let's test the content we created from Gravity Ray. Let's copy and paste it here. And if we click check, you can see we've got a great score. It says our content is more likely to be human written, which means our content is unique. This can help your blog to rank better on Google and also your readers will never feel it's AI generated. Okay, so guys, this is how you can create unique blog posts using AI. Now there's another feature in Gravity, right? That allows you to create quick content just by writing a blog title. So if you're in a hurry or need to create content quickly, you can check it out. So let's see how it works. Just go to Gravity, right? And select one click blog post. Now here, enter the title for your blog. So let me just enter a title. And if you click create content, you can see that we've got the content. Now this is more like an overview content. If you want a more elaborate blog, you can follow the steps we saw in the video. All right, so that's about it guys. I've given you the link to all the tools we use in the description. Do check it out and take your blogs to the next level. Now, not only blogs, there's more that we can do with AI tools. If you're a social media marketer or a content creator, we made a video specifically for you to create top-notch social media posts using AI. To learn more about it, you can watch this video. Also, don't forget to like, share and subscribe if you'd like to see more videos from us. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.